when I am so happily married, life may give me and my wife bad weather, but we will dodge hardships and bullets together. The struggle will be our tether, showing us we can overcome. Just due to a lot of different factors, demographics and you know, editorial boards, all that, we don't necessarily get a voice for black writers or black issues. That's where the need came from. But really, um, it's not an issue, a magazine or publication that's centered around, oh, writing's about the black experience or black issue. It's highlighting black writers. And that's, that's the key I want to put out there is we can still write about love. We can still write about our families. And yeah, you'll have black experiences in them, but not every piece is going to be about how I struggle. All right, for the first time, I actually met myself the other day. And he said, listen, everything is going to be okay, but you have to be real with yourself, and that's the only way. It gives black voices a chance to really express their art. So it's, it's a great platform to get your art out there and also be yourself. Right now, we're focusing on more the literature side of you know, fiction, poetry, and nonfiction. But in a few years, whoever's taking it over, I hope to see more visuals and really expand on what BARS is and what BARS means uh, to the people in, in Iowa City.